Magic wand filled without holes is used to simplify designs created from more complicated artwork. By clicking on the area around the details in this picture, stitches are going to be added to the larger area and the details will be ignored. So you can use this tool to eliminate the small details. Before I begin digitizing this, I'm going to change the size of the image. By pressing the one key, the design is shown in actual size. I'm going to change this percentage to 50% and press enter to resize the design. And then I'll press zero on the keyboard to show the image as large as it can be on my screen. I'll click on magic wand fill without holes and click on the picture to process the artwork. I'm just going to go ahead and click OK in the dialog box that opens. Remember, you will click on the areas in the background first and then objects in the foreground. So I will click on these objects. And notice that the details in the picture are ignored as I click using that. I can also add details. And I want to actually process the eyes. So I'm going to zoom in and click on the eyes to add the stitches to the eyes. Now to add an outline around the design, I'm going to choose Magic Wand Center Line. And I really want to zoom in the picture because I want to make sure I click on the outline. As long as the outlines around the images touch, there will be no jump stitches in the outline. If I want to delete the artwork from a design, I can come over to Color Film and select the picture that is in Color Film and press Delete. And this will eliminate the artwork. I want to select everything, go to my Effects menu, and change the pull compensation to 0.4 and click OK. Again, I am free to do any kind of editing I want in terms of colors, type of fill, angle of fill, and then I can save the design.